So as you can see the project is done, finally really really done, I even finished the cable check as I wanted it to be and in this video I'll show you all the steps to get to this point and in the end I'm going to give you a glimpse into the next big project. Last part of the puzzle, the plug. I managed with a lot of help from author, thank you for that, to create a replacement for this. This is the original part that was here. This is how the socket looks in Israel, the old one anyway. And I wanted to keep the original wire with the loom and have the USB end. And we started by creating just the layout, added the, the all the needed holes, and then we enlarged this part, and then eventually we made place for the screws. We kind of like eyeballed them. <laughs> So we had to go through several revisions and this is the last one. So now let's uh, wire it into here and I need to solder the inside here. This is how the breakout of the USB looks like. And now I'm just gonna cut uh, two wires. I think I'm gonna use the red and white. And I'm just gonna solder them to here. This goes directly into here. And then only thing I have to do, end up doing is connecting this back to here. Okay, let's get to solder. I solder the wires to the breakout. I've cut the third wire here. And now I'm just going to put a, a bit of a hard glue around this. So this won't be able to be pushed out. And a little bit of hard glue here so it won't get disconnected from here. Hard glue. And now I'm just going to... Put it all back. I used the original screws. I had to scrape off their lip, but it worked well. So just screw them back in and we got a working socket. Last task is to replace this wire with this. It's definitely been by far the more fun project I've done in very, very long time. And as I promised you, here is a glimpse for the next big project. Here it is, and all is mighty. A joystick again, blast from the past. Um, late 80s, early 90s, if I'm not mistaken, maybe a little bit later, I have to check myself. And I'm gonna be able to control it with a Duino. I even got this. Especially for this, even though we're not getting mail for a long time, this actually did arrive and it's a breakout for this socket. Next big step, I'm gonna take it apart and see how it works. Well, if you haven't done it by now, please subscribe, leave a comment, thumbs up, and see you next time.